<sighs> so relaxing. Are we gonna get anything? No. Hello? No, 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 no. That, that was my imagination. There's nothing there. Nothing there. It's just me in the slot machine and winning something cool, right? No, maybe not. I figured for a 25,000, or I guess at this point, it's a 35,000 subscriber special. I thought it'd be kind of fun to read you guys' comments and reply to the most commonly asked questions and all the funny ones. I have those same socks. In fact, I'm wearing them right now, lol. I have a lot of these socks. Apparently a lot of people like Costco socks too. Sock, 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 sock. Legend says he's still playing. What makes you say that? Just one more spin won't hurt, right? My dad had this exact same slot machine back in the 80s and 90s. I played it like a video game. If we got a jackpot, he would write us kids a check for $50. But dude, that's awesome. I hope you use those $50 to get more quarters to keep spinning the slot machine so that you keep winning more $50. I can see how this becomes a problem. Just one more. Video doesn't end until we win. Comes equipped with five quarters. I've got more quarters now. Look at all the quarters, man. All these came from winning. I am a winner. I'm not a winner. This unlocked a deep memory of mine where I hated a toy that was like this. It's so far back in my head, I can't remember anything more than that. It's just a game of luck. There's nothing to hate. Hate the player, not the game. Or is it the other way around? Is it hate the game and not the player? Or... Hold on. I'm out of quarters. Pulls out three more quarters. When you put your last quarter into the machine, this one quarter turns into like four or five more quarters that just turns into more and more quarters because they're definitely coming from the machine and not my pocket. He doesn't have a gambling addiction. He's got a gambling dedication. I like your thinking. I can quit anytime, bro. See, this man understands me. A prime example of how gambling addictions form, LMAO. Guys, it's not an addiction, I swear. Think about it. $0.25 from 1930 is $4.57 2023. What? He's not wrong. This man did his Googling, but my brain hurts. What point do you caught us in that slot machine when he don't hardly win anything? Maybe three forty-five, a waste of your money. I will use my money on other things besides pull my quarters in a slot machine back one or two quarters in that slot machine whooping you off. I give up on it. I hope we're doing okay. I get so many of these comments, dude. Where is the foot? Where is the foot? Where's the foot? We need the foot. Like we just, why we need the foot? Why are you guys obsessed with my foot? Where's the foot? Where's the foot? The machine goes boom, where's the foot? Guys, you don't need to see my foot. <laughs> I, what? Okay, okay, put your seatbelt on for this one. Can we get a banana for scale? Sure. I have here, your banana. I have here your slots machine. You wanted a scale with the banana to the slot machine. There you go. 25 cents was a lot of money back then. You are very right. 25 cents was approximately the equivalent of like $5. Nowadays, it's like, well, 25 cents is like half of a soda for McDonald's. But back in the day, 25 cents could buy you like five Snickers bars, a soda, a popcorn, and a movie ticket. They're grapes, not blueberries. Lol. Let's get the thumbs up to a thousand. If this video somehow in some crazy world gets a thousand likes, I will spin that old antique slot machine. I'm pointing over there because it's over there. I will spin the slot machine for like 15 minutes completely straight, upload that unedited to YouTube and let you just listen to the satisfaction. The jackpot it that you can get to pack a punch your weapon just got to a wonder weapon out of the misery box gets a teddy bear. Why me? The say the house always wins, except you are the house in this case. If I wasn't the house in this case, I would be down an astronomical amount of quarters. I would be down probably 1,700 of those quarters. Yes. Okay. Okay. I don't like watching it spin. I like your coping method to your gambling addiction. <laughs> I swear I don't. Hey man, your videos are awesome and satisfying. I love seeing you spin the slot machine. Keep on being you, man. Keep on being you, man. Can you open it up? Show us the inside. I can. This is what the inside of the machine looks like. It's, uh, I don't know. It's essentially just a bunch of metal and springs and levers and pulleys, and they all kind of work together, and they make the machine spin. I'll do you a spin with the cover off so you can see everything move. But, I mean, that's what it looks like. It's pretty cool. We need the food. Food. Hey, this is editing Andrew. I realized that I didn't answer one of the most common questions, which was, 
Where do you find one of these slot machines? And the best place to find one of these slot machines of all the places is eBay. Check eBay. That's where you can find some of these cool antique slot machines. But I'm going to tell you right now, they're kind of expensive. Use antique quarters. You will get luckier and win more. Am I really about to do this? I really hope you're right about the silver quarters being a little luckier. I have a 1947 quarter and a dateless standing Liberty quarter here. And you know that these are silver because listen to the sound that they make when I drop it versus a regular quarter. I can't believe I'm actually about to do this. Here goes the 1947 quarter. Let's see if it's any luckier. Come on, give it to us. We're putting an actual silver quarter in. No, no, look at it go, no. We're gonna try one more time. Here's the standing Liberty quarter. This thing is from like the 1920s or 1930s. This thing is old. This is as old as this machine. It's not lucky. Anyways, that's gonna wrap up the video. I hope you guys enjoyed the uh, quick little subscriber special. And I know this was playing in the background. So here is the satisfying corner. Oh, ho, ho, ho.